Dude, we have some major Roblox news today, and I'm just gonna speed through them, because I have, like, seven stories I want to get through, okay? There's so much cool stuff, and just new stuff, and, uh, huge Roblox games being hacked and deleted, and just so much more, dude. It's insane. Some YouTubers are in trouble. It, it's really, it's really epic. Roblox Mobile is broken. I can't even. There's just so much stuff, and I have to fit it all in one video. Um, but before I do, I need to thank my subscribed subscribers. If you're subscribed, you get a thank you at the beginning of all my videos. Thank you so much. Specifically to you. I can see you. I'm staring through the screen right now. And if you're not subscribed, I am also still staring through the screen and uh you're cringe you look cringe if you subscribe you're gonna you'll get a really cool haircut and you'll look really awesome anyways let's, <laughs> let's i don't even know what i was saying news time first story guys roblox scammed their players guys <laughs> basically mariah carey had some hair on roblox and it's no longer on the website guys i know it's no longer on the website guys it's no longer there i don't even know why i saw like a bunch of tweets where people were like dude what hair got deleted i'm missing a hair and i i want to refund there was a lot of people that didn't even know it was mariah Mariah Carey's hair, but it was. So I guess these, I don't know if this costed money. So I don't know if Roblox really did scam anybody. I mean, obviously they're probably going to pay people back if it did cost money. It, it's a Roblox thing. They just do this sometimes. But I think the main question is, is why? Why did they delete Mariah Carey's hair? What did she do? I don't know. I haven't been keeping up with pop culture. Maybe, maybe she did something terrible. But, like, why her hair? I don't get it. I don't understand. But it is deleted right now. Let's move on to the next story, which is uh, just YouTube tweeting out this. Basically, YouTube said, My sleep paralysis demon looks like a Roblox character. This sparked outrage. Why is YouTube so positively or negatively talking about Roblox? But yeah, I also agree. I do see little Roblox people in my nightmares, and it is terrifying. But yeah, it was just, like, a small little tweet that I thought was funny. And uh, a lot of other people did, too. Because every single Roblox YouTuber under the freaking sun talked about it, bro. <laughs> also, there there's a lot of other people like a uh, soft willy <laughs> whoever is tweeting on this account please shut i do agree this was a kind of a it was one of those like corporate tweets you know this is something like burger king would tweet just to think that they're like hip with the kids or something but i don't know it's a whatever tweet i thought it was kind of interesting and it's roblox related so I'm, I'm, I'm gonna talk about it but anyways let's move on to the bigger stories okay such as so, this was already talked about by many people but captain jack attack is a doors youtuber who was recently hacked so i don't know how much information i'm allowed to go here but i do know how he got hacked and uh guys i'm not gonna say exactly what happened but uh it, it's it, if you've been like paying attention to how youtubers got hacked recently uh that's exactly what happened okay so captain jack attack uh got completely hacked i think his second channel was the only thing that got like fully hacked but he was not able to access his main channel um because i guess they were on the same email or something i didn't know this part of the information at all I'm just going to assume that, uh, because he did put out a tweet, and I forget what the tweet said, but I think it said something similar. I don't know. Basically, his second channel was terminated or something in the, in the crossfire, and uh, that meant that he was not allowed to get into his main channel, and uh, yeah, basically, he was just hacked pretty badly but um it seems like he's got everything back which is really cool and uh yeah i'm pretty happy about that uh that was very quick of him to get his stuff back now let's do another quick thing because uh th this happened a lot or, or a lot of people talked about this because it happened uh and it was major news i don't know why did i say that anyway prison life you know the game you know the name it's basically just the old jailbreak if you've never played it uh very surprised but i mean it's even popular today prison life uh if you look it up it has thousands of players somehow uh the game has was not updated in two years i even made a video or like a short about it but uh the basic consensus was that uh this game is ran by hack so basically if you join any prison life uh server it's just full of exploiters right and i guess that finally caught up to prison life a couple days ago because somehow the map in the game like exploded i don't even know how to explain it. this is what the map looked like i'll try and find an image of it and uh yeah that happened okay and a lot of people were saying it was hacked but i mean i don't know for sure nobody knows why this happened i'm gonna assume it was a roblox glitch just because the game is so old probably okay i mean apparently the map looked like that in private servers so yeah i don't think it was a i don't think it was a hack problem like i don't think people were hacking away the map or anything i think it was just a roblox glitch like a really really weird roblox glitch but uh all of this weird stuff happening to prison life actually pushed the developer to update it as you can see if you go to prison life it says it was updated two days ago which it, uh, which like a week ago it said that it was last updated two years ago so yeah the first prison life update in two years was finally shipped out and uh it's yeah it exists now also apparently they fixed a couple of exploits so that's pretty cool uh yeah prison life got revived guys it's pretty epic but now let's move on to the next story which is uh roblox is still banning people 
So if you guys don't remember, uh, like uh, almost a month ago at this point, I got banned on Roblox because of a exploit that was going around where people basically go into your game that have low visit counts and they do inappropriate exploits where they have like uh, inappropriate animations and stuff. And then they basically get a moderator to join your game and then it bans you and your game. Now this happened to me twice. They banned two of my games and uh, both of the both of the games are still down. Like you can't play any of the games, which kind of sucks. Uh, Roblox, if you're watching this, please uh, review my game. I would like to put it back up. But yeah, basically that was a huge thing that was happening a month ago and uh you know it slowed down you know I, st I started seeing less and less people get banned by this but apparently it hasn't stopped because i've been looking through twitter and i've been seeing multiple of the exact same ban notes like here's another one for example my 11 year old account was just deleted for something we have no idea what it's for he's been a game creator for a number of years i've been paying for premium and i have no idea what might have been the issue he wasn't even playing today so as you can see they even say in this tweet that he's a game creator and uh that's how they got a ban and i've seen so many uh, exactly like similar like tweets and just posts like this every single day i check twitter i see a new like one to three posts of the exact same thing so yes this exploit isn't patched i guess i thought it was patched but it's not i remember talking about it in an older video but i guess yeah i was just mistaken maybe they slowed down on banning people for this but uh yeah it's definitely not patched and uh games are still being banned and people <laughs> but now let's move on to another game banning situation where uh, basically there was this game called rh dance studio anyways uh dance studio game it's basically a game where you just do like dances and stuff i think it's uh i don't know exactly how the game works but uh yeah it's a very 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 popular just like music type game where you can listen to music and do like emotes and stuff like that yeah it's very interesting i don't know exactly what the appeal is but i kind of see it maybe but yeah it has a lot of players so i mean it's obviously a good game like right now it has 2,000 players as i'm recording this and it also has 30 million visits almost but uh recently it was actually hacked the group in the game were completely hacked I, I i have limited amounts of knowledge about this because you know not a lot of people tweeted about it but uh yeah i basically have this screenshot uh where they actually got their games back but yeah basically this game was uh hacked and deleted and their group but uh it seems like they got it back and the reason i say it was deleted was because they actually had to re-upload the game for a little while um but now they d they have it back like they don't have to re-upload the game at all they literally just have it back and it's a very popular game and i just wanted to talk about it because i think it's kind of important so yeah roblox please stop banning these games uh th they're pretty epic even if they get hacked guys come on now to move on to the next story which is uh, a new roblox update which is really cool so i saw this on reddit and i think it's fake but let me just look at it and maybe you guys can tell me in the comments if it's real so basically there's a new sort called uh childhood games on the roblox front page and such now i think this is either a part of an extension or just completely fake because as you can see here it has untitled tag game now i don't know how this is a childhood game i think this the untitled tag game came out in like the past two years or so maybe i'm wrong but uh yeah i swear untitled tag game came out recently ish but yeah the other games there are yeah very childhood-esque games wait no maybe not orangutag that is that seems pretty new that's like a gorilla tag clone but blocks hunt and then super simon says or whatever the heck that is yeah those are old games and all the comments aren't saying it's fake but i think it is but if it is real tell me in the comments because uh i can't find this sort myself so i, I i'm gonna assume that it's fake but tldr roblox should still add this sort dude this is really cool and uh yeah roblox you should just look at this at the roblox reddit bro they give you million dollar ideas every day like actually add this onto the website and you will be a bajillionaire roblox i'm telling you and uh yeah that's pretty epic i mean i i wish it was real i don't think it's real I, i'm very on the fence here i don't want to be too too gullible but uh you know now let's move on to the next and the last story okay which is roblox on mobile being completely broken for like the past year or something but it's only been really brought uh, brought in to people's attention recently so if you guys had uh ever play on mobile on uh, any device i guess i used to think this was just an apple device thing but apparently this is happening on every single device ever okay so here's one reddit post about it basically saying why is this happening uh, when i entered roblox uh, and it just shows like roblox with a bunch of squares and and gray squares and black squares and stuff like that and yeah basically every single element on the roblox website is just blank and you know there's multiple versions of this glitch happening to a lot of people like on iphone it makes your screen flash pink and apparently this pink version of the glitch actually happens inside of games too yeah it's really weird and i don't know why this happens and i don't know if it's been happening forever but uh, th apparently there's been like a crazy influx of this happening to people on mobile uh recently but anyways that's roblox news uh bye bye